Hello everyone on the internet, this is Ryu Kiva from Ryu Kiva Tokyo with another Tokyo unboxing. Uh, this is SH Figure Arts Skyrider. I mean, it says Skyrider on here, though anyone who knows anything knows that during the original series he was never called Skyrider at all, he was just the new Kamen Rider, I guess. Uh, looking at the box, I mean, I've not opened this before, but it's the same guy that sold me Stronger. Says it's new, but from the box it looks like the seal was broken and resealed, but I'm going to say that I'm just going to assume it is new, even though, again, I very much doubt it. On the box, you know, unlike a lot of the others, this one's pictured with, uh, like, a little posing stand thing, so hopefully it'll come with one. If it doesn't, whatever. Uh, actually, I mean, it's a bit bland, but the, the box doesn't give anything away, so it is going to require an open and see scenario. And again, I'm opening this for the first time. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see what's inside. Right. Okay. Right, there. What's this? Right, so it does come with a stand. Uh, uh, right. Again, very plasticky. Again, this will tell me if it's no. Right, I mean, the, the stand is sealed. Uh, has a little picture of sailing jumpu on it. Uh, so this should be quite interesting. I mean, I am now ripping it apart. Lol. Uh, looking at the figure, comes with... Uh, did he have a scarf? He has like a cape and a scarf. And two sets of hands. Uh, I mean, the hands that are attached are fists. I think this must be an SHF thing or Kamen Rider thing. That they are naturally. And then it's again a set of hands. You know, two sets of hands. One hand with the hand open, closed fingers, and then one with just open fingers. Right. Uh, look, this has got some melt. These have got some nuts in it, man. Right. So yeah. Oh well. At least I've put some effort into making a good stand. Right. Hurt a good stand. I'm funny. Right. Um. All right, so that's what that is there. So for some odd reason, like, they've given one part in the box of the figure, the rest is all wrapped in the plastic bag, which it's like, why don't you just put all the plastic parts together? Oh, these structures. They're going to be in Japanese. Yep, they're in Japanese. All right. Yeah, you can put the hands on the arms, you can put... Right, so apparently the neck... I'm, I'm not too sure about the other figures, but the neck comes off on this one as well. Right, so you can either balance him in that like that, or put the claspy thing on, and it clasps the figure. Well, I'll play around with the rest of that in a minute. Let's have a look at the figure. Man, he's so skinny! I mean, this is the original incarnation of Sky Rider, or New Kamen Rider, before he gets a power-up and then his suit becomes a lot brighter. He looks really thin and skinny. The attention, not the attention to detail on the helmet is actually pretty good. He does look. It's very. I mean, I didn't notice in the show, but his helmet does have a lot of resemblance to Ichigo. I don't know why I didn't notice that watching the show, but I was just like, oh, new Carmen Rider. Yeah, all right. Uh, the belt, belt's a bit flimsy. He's got a bit of a plastic thing there. Remove that. Um, ugh, the belt comes apart a bit. It's very, it's very loosely hung, slung on his waist. Uh, but uh, yeah, I think I remember it being like switches like that. So the switches go up and down. But again, the belt is quite loose. This is a very skinny figure. He looks really skinny, especially compared to the ones that I've unboxed so far. Ah, uh, uh, I need food. Right, seriously. All right, let's have a go at taking the head off. Oh, and look, the neck's right there. Um, get, tells you all the different combinations of putting a scarf on. I mean, actually, that's not a cape. It is a scarf. It's quite an intricate one, this. Uh, right, so basically that is a neck with the scarf, or you could just have just the neck. Right, so it does feel a little sturdier, but it also feels very clicky. Right, 
to be fair, I've just done this, and the scarf really throw like yeah. Without that stand, it really throws the balance off the Sky Rider. The Sky Rider, lol. All right, yeah. Uh, let's just have a go at the hands. I mean, he didn't have any weapons, did he? No, he did not. At least the hands didn't jump out. He's got no wishy wush thing. That's in my eyes, that's a bonus because I don't see the point in those wishy wush things. The hands look almost like PV. They have like a very PVC feel to it. I don't know if that's deliberate. Hey, that's not too bad. I mean, at least he's got a little bit more balance to him. Yeah, flexible. No, he doesn't have. No, he does have flexible toes. It's just actually, this figure is a little bit more sturdy. Uh, limbs feel quite, you know, like articulate, premium. He twists around. Yeah, and that's him looking at the scar. I don't know what combination of that. Yeah, that is the correct hand. All right, let's have a quick go with the stand anyway. So this is the regular stand. Hurt. That's very Superman. Oh, that's very Superman-ish. This stand. That is actually quite funny. Um, let's try the other attach stand attachment. This one's a little, yeah. This one points him upright. So I guess you got a little. Yeah. I guess with this one you can do him upside down. And yeah. I guess I prefer this figure. It's not too bad. Plus, he comes with a stand, so that's a bonus. So, I can't really complain. Alright, that's my unboxing. Ciao.